Here's Chief Meteorologist Gannon Medwick with your first alert forecast. And your forecast is first here at 513. Good to see you. We've got warm sun and a few clouds possibly mixing on the menu for today. Seasonable temperatures and what I'll call and couch as pleasant breezes out of the east. We're going to keep that easterly flow. Uh, if it doesn't go down to zero, which it tends to do at night on the mainland, but that easterly flow backing in some moisture from the Atlantic. So we're trending a bit muggier with time, but I think we keep it dry as far as our skies for Friday to wrap up the work and school week. So overall, same kind of flavor. Here's your 3 p.m. Eastern U.S. cloud future radar model. So you pick out our corner. Decently sunny, a few clouds have a seat at the table, but some showers and storms, the rain clouds, that part is to the west. A bit of a low pressure you can kind of see chugging through the Tennessee and Ohio River Valleys. And so we just chugged through 24 hours of time, and you notice we're still in a dry pocket here in the Cape Fear region, certainly, but almost all of the eastern Carolinas collectively. Let's move you forward 24 hours more at no extra charge. That low pressure system morphs into a rain shield or it helps produce one in the mid Atlantic. But that's Saturday at 3 p.m. We're still eking out some dryness. And you'll see that reflected in your seven day forecast coming up. We'll also showcase Mom's Day front and center. Let's get you outside in the meantime with your West Shore home first alert sky cam from Oliver's on the Cape Fear, Southport checking out Oak Island Light. You see it gleaming at us. There's a glimmer in the distance over the intracoastal at Caswell Beach. Let's move to the Murkison Building view in downtown Wilmington. It's a nice view over front and princess, mostly clear and 60 degrees. The latest observation from ILM Airport. It's been interesting to see if the airport manages to wiggle into the uh, 50s. It's on the precipice right now. A northeast breeze, the latest observation, very modest. Uh, modest six miles an hour. Dew point temperatures are comfortable enough in the 40s and 50s. Doesn't start to feel more humid till we get them into the 60s and certainly the 70s, and that's not on the table today. Air temperatures themselves mainly in the 50s and 60s. If you're getting ready to step outside, your visibility map is good. We'll be watching it closely with those temps close to their dew points. It's not out of the realm of possibility that a stray patch of fog forms, uh, but I think we keep that radar scan clean. Hope you keep your sinuses clean with the grass pollen going gangbusters as it usually does at this point. That's your Thursday allergy report. Various grasses. We're at the intersection of a lot, a lot of things that grow. Here's your three expanding to seven day planning forecast. A little more of a summery flavor for Mom's Day weekend. Can't rule out a shower or storm, but I think a lot of dry time. Kim, back to you.